I suppose the sheriff might say, uh, say something. I wonder if the kids would say anything. I probably shouldn't be talking to you. Billy says I get too friendly with people I don't know. She says it's dangerous. You do not seem to care. I gotta go. Bye, mister. Need something? Yeah, I don't think anyone is really gonna care about Fox, in all honesty. Hey there. They probably won't even notice, That's um, sure that I've got Fox coming with me. At least that's how it seems so far. Lucy. Hello there. Nice to see you. You think of anything? No. Got to go. Oh. Okay. Well, anytime you find yourself back in Megaton, be sure and look me up. Not that you say anything worth looking you up for. Evening. Mori, where are you? There you are. And no luck finding dear old dad. Can't say it surprises me. Wasteland's a big place. Maybe you need a drink. Oh, I found him just fine. I gotta go. I await our next meeting with bated breath. There, isn't it? I would love to shoot your face off, but uh, I think everyone else would be angry at me. Sup, Gop? Oh, man. And you don't seem to care about anything. I gotta go. I'm tired. I think I'm gonna knock off early. Alright, well, I guess it's time to go off to the Citadel, see what they have to say about the situation. You don't shoot a fox, okay? You do, I kill you. Shoot at me, I kill you. Shoot at my dog, I kill you. Basically, if you breathe, I kill you. Aha. Uh -huh. You look very armorless. I think I get what you're talking about. When I let go and see only the target, the bullets fly right where I want them to go. When you've reached a new level of understanding, combat does not take place in the brain. It is passion, instinct, and the will to survive. I understand, sir. Thank like you, sir. Fill your soul with thunder. Fight with the heart of steel. So it was taught to me. So will you teach it someday. And up job, maggot. Back to work. Hail. He's nice. Alright, well, anyway, let's see. We need to go over this way somewhere. So let's find out where we're off to. What are you guys talking about? Well, whatever it was, you're done now. And doing push-ups. Good for you. You, uh, you keep on that. I will move along. Looks like they're having a meeting of some sort down here. All I'm saying is, the longer we sit here, the more time they have to shore up their defenses. We should hit them sooner rather than later. We barely have the manpower to keep the Citadel fortified. We've been over this before, Sarah. So we just wait until they decide we're next on the list? If the pride goes in now, we might have a chance. And if you fail, then what? The risk is not worth the reward. I agree. Without the Gek, the Purifier is useless to the Enclave anyway. They may give up before long. I don't like it. They have the Gek, though. You don't have though. to like it, Sarah. You just have to follow orders. Yes, Father. So, you're back. We had feared both you and the Gek were lost. Were you successful? In a way, I sort of found the Gek. Excellent. With that, we hold the key to keeping the Enclave from controlling the Purifier. Well, it's not quite that simple. What do you mean? Explain yourself. The Enclave took the Gek. They're installing it right now. Then we must go at once. If you have any other information, tell me now before we mobilize. Any help you can give might save lives. He didn't want me to sabotage the product with some kind of virus. I see. And where is this virus now? Hmm. 
I don't have it anymore. Just as well, no good could come from it. We need to decide on a course of action. Something must be done. If the Enclave has the Gek, there's nothing stopping them from starting the Purifier. They'll figure out the code eventually. I'm afraid you're right. We need to act now while we can. Send the Pride in. We can do it. We can win this. All right, Sarah. The Pride goes in. But I want them to have some extra firepower. Rothschild, is it ready? What? No, I, I mean, Lee and I have solved the power problems, but we've only barely finished diagnostic tests. So? It's not ready for field tests, let alone live fire situations. The weapons haven't been calibrated, the navigation detection system is offline. Rothschild enough. Can you make it work? Honestly? I don't know. I think we can scrape by, and I suppose if we can't, it won't matter in the long run anyway. Then it's decided. Sarah, you take the pride and use the robot as support. Take our friend here and secure that purifier. Yes, sir. The robot, huh? Before we get started, I wanted to let you know that my father and I have been talking. Yeah? The pride and I have decided that after all you've survived, you've done enough to be an honorary member of Lion's Pride. So congratulations. Membership comes with some privileges, including our power armor. You want the full suit or the recon armor? Um... Honestly, I don't really want any of it, but... Uh... I guess I'll take the recon armor. Alright, here you go. I hope it fits. So you think you can handle this? Of course I can. Now that's what I like to hear, soldier. You all packed? We're not coming back here anytime soon. I'm all ready. Okay, don't be nervous. You'll have the whole pride backing you up, not to mention this giant tin can. Just stay safe until we reach the purifier. You're no good to us if you're dead. And don't let that thing step on you. I have been across the entire okay. wasteland. I'm not going to die. One more time. The pride is on me. The goal is Project Purity, but we can't get into the facility with those energy fields up. Rothschild and Lee say this robot should be able to take down the energy fields. So we're on fire support. We stay close to the thing, keep it clear, and get it to where it needs to go. Once the fields are down, we head straight for the facility. We'll use the robot to keep them occupied while we get inside and secure the control room. We need to move quickly before we lose the chance to surprise them. Get whatever supplies you don't already have, and we'll meet in the Bailey. When we're done with this, everyone can have a nice cold glass of water on me. Let's move. All right, Rothschild, fire it up. Pride, move out. That thing looks pretty badass. Alright. We are done with the American Dream. Let's check out this armor that she gave us. I think it's just regular recon armor. Yeah, it's, um... Nothing I really care about, in all honesty. I'm just gonna let that plop on the floor. The big idea? I just don't care about, uh, about the armor. Alright. Liberty Prime, huh? So, uh, guess the robot's Liberty Prime. And I guess we're gonna see it in action. Should be interesting. Huh. Using a crane to get it out of here. Nice! Let's just hit the building with it. Good job, guys. Oy. Could we actually get someone who knows how to operate a crane? Because that would be fan frickin' tastic right now. Are these guys, like, following me? No, I guess they're, uh, they're just going through here. Oh, 
explosions. Damn, that thing is huge. Awesome. <laughs> That's pretty fucking epic. All right, buddy. Let's uh, let's see what you can do. That's not a Chinese invader, but okay. <laughs> this thing is awesome! I would not want to get in this thing's way, that's for sure. Obstruction detected. Composition. Titanium alloy supplemented by photonic resonance barrier. Probability of mission hindrance. Zero percent. <laughs> Oh, this robot is epic. Actually, you know what? I want that plasma rifle. Man, just his boots are left standing. Freedom is the Whoa! Like a nuclear grenade. That's pretty awesome. Oh. Should be shooting shit at me. It's amazing, for once I don't have to do any work. I can just watch this guy do work. It's like War of the Worlds here or something. Don't sneeze on him, he might die. Don't want it. You guys doing okay? Fox looks a little bit damaged, but dog meat's pretty good. I remember coming here through here before. There was like an overlord up there before. Or something. We were shooting him. The last domino falls here. <laughs> Watch yourself, robot. Apparently I can't aim at him at all. And he actually waits for me. Interesting. The last domino falls here. Oh. Alright, keep going, buddy. Communism is a lie. And Alaska's liberation is imminent. Time for actual fighting. <laughs> this certainly feels more like an epic battle than any other battle that we've been in before. No thanks. No, no, I don't wanna. Good boy. Good boy for going over here and eating the goo. I, I gotta go. Never mind. I don't even care about the goo. It's fine. What are you shooting at? Whoa. Well, so much for that, uh. Freedom. Virtue bird. Birdie bird? What was it again? <laughs> We're rocking these guys. And they are glitching out. Man, that is a lot of explosions. I'm 
including a lot of flesh just exploding everywhere. Guess that's the same guy. He's just everywhere. What are you doing, man? Come on. It's all good, buddy. We're almost in here. Seriously? That actually managed to stop you? No, I guess not. You, uh, you don't look like you're gonna last too much longer, though. Considering you're kinda stumbling a bit. That is such an awesome grenade. Bush. Watch it, bud. I'm gonna stomp on some people here. I guess he's just defending the compound now. Can we actually aim at him? No, we can't. Still more around here? They're people, of course they bleed just like anything else. What are you talking about? You know what? We're gonna take out something uh, a little bit bigger, I think. For the hell of it. Oh, I might mean that Fox is gonna die. I do not want Fox to die. Cause I don't believe he can come back. Where is Fox? He's right there. He looks okay. He looks okay for the moment. Oh, this is fun. How you doing, Fox? Oh, you looking just fine. Alright. Well, that puppy is still not very powerful, but you know, what can you do? He's a dog. Can't be helped. What nice stuff here. Piles and piles of people. What did you think you were going to do? You don't even have any sort of armor on. That's ridiculous. Well, it seems like this area is uh, mainly cleared out right now. I guess at this point it's, uh, it's time to get in there. See what we can do. So I'll just take my stairs over here down. Can we come in from this direction? I don't know. We might not be able to. We might not be able to. No. There's a distinct possibility that I need to be over on the other side instead of over here. Oh well. Had to check over it. 